hello and welcome back to my channel welcome if you are new i am a stranger the gamer and i am playing the 100 baby challenge so as you can see we are at our baby daddy house okay we at our baby daddy house and we still kind of flirting with our baby daddy and everything but of a uh what we really doing is we want to come over here and meet the other people that live in this house. Okay. Look at what she decided to wear, y'all. Look what she decided to wear. <laughs> Where is her stomach at? Is it inside his body or what? I'm so unsure at this point. <laughs> I am unsure where her belly at. This is so weird. This is this is really weird. But I do want her to go up there and knock on that door and meet other people. They got an open relationship. So I don't know if y'all remember this place that I made. Um, little apartments. It's more like a frat house. You know, it's got a bunch of potential baby daddies in here. They little mailbox. They got some mail. Okay, and over uh, this is the upstairs. It's basically still look the same. I ain't did nothing different to it. This is the downstairs. Both of the apartments pretty much got the same stuff, just the rooms are the decorated differently. Then they got the little dumpsters back here. They got the little setup back there for them to barbecue, and then they have like a laundromat and a gym. So she literally, her goal is to meet everybody in this house. What did it say his name was? Oh, Lamar. Yeah, we need to meet everybody in here. Okay. I don't know if y'all remember. I did do a little challenge with Deacon in there. Oh, uh, did I do? No, his name was Sergeant. I did a different game with Deacon. His name was Deacon. But it's not nobody at this one over here. So what we want to do is we actually want to go over here. And uh, we meeting teenagers too, but the teens supposed to be at work. But we gonna come over here and meet us some teenagers because you know what happens? The teenagers grow up into young adult. So she got a few more days, you know what I'm saying, before she become an adult and she's still gonna need to have another slew of children. And as you notice, all the townies done died off. Okay, she didn't just had another baby daddy that died. And of a uh, she ain't playing no games. It said insult. What's his name? His name Yard. Okay, talk about the neighborhood changes. His name is Antoine. So she gonna talk to this guy. And uh, I mean, she can talk to this dude. Discuss some video games. Okay, is he on the board yet? That's what we want to do. We want to make sure he on the board. Okay, boom. There he is. We can invite him over. Next. Did that guy leave? Come over here and talk to this guy. Go do a... Uh, uh, any other type of introductions you can do? Girl, you can't do no, um, no other introductions at this point. Well, come over here and do a flirty introduction with this guy. Oh, he finna come over to you. Ooh, where Jody at? Is Jody over here? Cause Jody gonna be jelly. Jody gonna be jelly. Jody is gonna be jelly, baby. You sitting up here talking to his little, his little roommate. We do not care. We need to get over here and get us some people on the board. Okay. So we need to try to see what we can uh queue up. Ask him if he's single and then um, exchange numbers and of a uh, we just going to try to queue up as much stuff as we can. We do want to try to, we do want to try to get to know these guys, but I mean, it's not a requirement. It's most definitely not a requirement. I'm pretty sure I didn't, I didn't queue her up to, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's talking to both of these guys. She do not care. She do not care. Tell him a funny story. Is he on the board? 
Uh 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 uh. He ain't like it. He bored. But you know what? All we care about is is you on the board, son. Oh uh, look at her. She got gray hair finally. Okay, so these this is our baby daddy. Oh my goodness, our oldest child is an elder. Look at Antoine. He an elder, y'all. He is an elder. Oh, that's our other baby daddy. He an elder now. So that means that, okay, that guy's on the board. Where is Brandon? Brandon is an elder. Coffee. Coffee's still an adult. Okay. They finna be sad. The whole family about to be sad once them siblings start dying off. It's gonna be hard. I don't even know why I just waste my time. Stop talking to him. He feeling embarrassed. Okay, so where the other men at that's, that live in this place? They not nowhere. See, when I'm not, when I'm just watching the video, it's different. But when I'm playing, I promise you, I don't see nobody. Is anybody over here in the gym? No. Um, is they upstairs sleep? Maybe they at work. Maybe that other teenager actually went to school and see a teenager. There's another teenager that live here. And I don't even see our baby daddy. Okay. So we're going to be bold. We have the always welcome trait. We're going to come in here and serve some. Um, no, we're not going to do that. It's, it's still breakfast time. I thought it's brunch. Why is this food so high? Y'all tripping, bro. We just finna cook something, okay? Cause they tripping. We just finna make us some popcorn shrimp. Stop talking to them clowns. Stop talking to them. I don't know where everybody else at. Okay, so this our baby daddy. We gonna come on over here and, and sit with him. Look at him. Are you watching the Oh, yeah, he watching the cooking channel. He gaining cooking skills over there. We just sitting over here chilling because our children is at school. They is at school. They look like they may come home with it, uh, a good grade. Okay. I worked on them really hard and made sure that they um got their knees and stuff together. So yeah, they may go on and um and do good. They still feeling sad though. I can't help that. I cannot. This chicken here looking like she's straight setting stuff on fire. And they in these people house. Okay, girl, go on and grab this and put it in your inventory. And come on over here. You I know you gotta go next door. Wait, somebody just came down them steps. Who was it? Who was it? I thought I just saw somebody come downstairs. Am I tripping? Or did they go upstairs? No? Okay. I I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Okay, I want you to come over here. Go sit over there with your baby daddy. Because you did come over here to rap to your baby daddy. Don't be funny act. So come on over here and talk to your baby daddy. Ask him if he want to invite to feel your belly. Invite your baby daddy to feel your belly. Uh, stop talking to us right now. We over here entertaining. We is over here entertaining, okay? We is over here. I'm trying to get a picture of our baby daddy. I want to try to make sure that I take a picture that actually look like we not in our own house. Cause you know. Oh, yeah, baby, daddy, is is that is his fingers glitching through? Is his fingers glitching through? That look weird, but okay. Okay, you know what? You know, since we got you here, baby, daddy, you know, go on and 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 get us straight, okay? Since we already over her. Uh-uh, not in the dumpster. Not in the dumpster, you say? 
She feeling sad. Can you help her out? Can you help her with her sad? So nobody else is here. Oh, this guy. Who is this guy? We don't know this guy. We need the no, that's Antoine. Who who oh, is this? This the teenager? Well, I promise these teenagers look like grown men. They look like grown men. Okay? Let a boy be a boy and let a man be a man. But what about a child that look like a man? That little boy is supposed to have went to school. Playing hooky. You're playing hooky. So she's just over here chilling. It's almost time for her children to come home. And she need to get gone. She need to get gone, but she going to go on and get herself straight before she leave, if you know what I mean. If you know what I mean, I'm going to have her to take her a little quick shower before she leave, because that's just trifling. Okay. But she going to get her fun and her social. Make sure she stay in the good. <laughs> but she didn't met two people over here. I, I know it's more guys live here, but whatever. I don't see them. Maybe they at work because some of them did work at the spa. Ooh, maybe she should go to the spa. Okay, bye, boo. Bye, boo thing. Is he coming in the bathroom with us? <laughs> I'll tell you about when you get comfortable, perk. <laughs> like, uh, excuse me. Excuse me. You know? We gonna have to keep him on board. Normally we say, you know, we just want to be friends and whatnot. But we gonna have to go on and keep him on board because we need somebody. Look at Jody calling us. While we in the house, jo <laughs> Jody, Jody asking us, do we want to go bowling? Okay. Hey, Casey, it's me, Jody. Do you want to go out on a date? New Crest Bowling Alley. Uh, no, thanks, Jody. We are good. Okay. We good. We need to go home. Our children's about to come home. And you know what? They got to stay on task. So we messed around for as long as we can mess around. And we only come out the house to meet us some new potential baby daddies. And we did that. So we headed back to the crib. We is headed back to the... Where you get the outfit from? Girl. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. You came home in a whole nother outfit, okay? Got you. So we want to see if you can come in here and first I'm gonna just let you stand in here. Go on and go on and have you stand here. Jog in here, ma'am. And let's see what's going on with the babies. Babies, y'all need to go on and try to get y'all um I don't remember throwing nothing away before I left, but okay. The babies, where are your tablets at? Boom, yours is suspended in the air. Got you. Boom. Uh, what's your thinking skill look like? So, Apple, she has a two in communication, a two in imagination, a two in movement. That She mastered potty, and she has a two in thinking. And Zach has a three in communication. He's almost at level four. He has a three in imagination. He's 50% before he'll be a level four. And he has a two in movement. A three in potty and a two in thinking. We're going to have him work on his thinking. Um, if we could find his tablet. If. I think he got his tablet, but okay. Okay, because I, I wasn't sure for a second. So mom, it's Monday. Okay. And mom need to pay the bills. She need to pay the bills. And the bills is nine thousand six hundred and six. I mean nine thousand sixty eight dollars. She finna pay that, and I'm hoping it don't make her stay. But she do got this popcorn shrimp in her inventory, and we wants to take it out and put it in our refrigerator because 
we made that at our BBDD house. So I do want her to come over here and make a painting because for some reason she has not been um been making masterpieces. And I'm so interested in why, because she has mastered painting a long time ago. And she also mastered the painting aspiration. I mean, not mastered it, but she completed the painting aspiration. So I don't understand why she's not making masterpieces. But it's almost time for them children to come home. And of course, they coming home feeling sad. I mean, she feel okay because she talked her sadness down. But should youngster invite over a classmate, ISO, I, uh, is that a girl or a boy? Uh, this baby got a rainbow. Why is it that this baby is the only one with a rainbow? So this baby has a B. Whoopi has a B, Xavier has a C. Why? Why does Xavier have a C? It's always that one kid. Xavier had everything that he needed. I don't understand. Xavier is a level seven. I don't even know what to say. You know, I get very upset and frustrated. Not, I mean, not just frustrated, but I get very upset with the game when I feel like it's cheating. Like, I feel like those kids had everything that they needed. You know what I'm saying? I don't understand why the, the baby didn't come with a good grade. And it seemed like it always happened when you got these triplets. Uh, Okay. I told this boy that he can invite somebody over and I think this is the kid. And now I'm going to say, no, I'm going to say, no, you can't invite nobody over. You can't come in here. Don't come in this house. Send, send that kid home. Send that kid home. Okay. Get out of here. You're not coming in here. They ain't do good in school. Get out of here. They can't have company. They all need to sit up and do their homework. And for some reason, this kid feel like he finna go do something different. If you don't get your butt in here and sit down and do that homework, is this the kid with the C? So it's Xavier that has the C. It was youngster pulling up the rear when they was aging up as a child. So I was very curious if it was youngster because i can't remember i can't remember but that is so unfortunate because that means tomorrow when they go to school they will probably get an a and be teenagers but because somebody we ain't gonna mention his name came home with a c they gonna still be children tomorrow because they all gotta age up together Okay, so she can do a masterpiece. Cool, cool, cool. This baby finna go play with a toy. I need him to go sit down and complete his thinking. Let's see where he at with his thinking. Yes, you need to go sit your butt back down. Mom, you got a masterpiece. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Are well, you still inspired? Because we need you to make some more money. Because you just spent half your income on that last bill. Well, almost half. Bill was 9000 So, Whoopi, you done with your homework. Let's see what we can cue you back up with. You still finna sit here, and you need to do your extra credit homework. This baby need to sit up and do his extra credit homework. Oh, my God. Do you even have an option for extra credit homework? Boy, this up. This child don't even have an option for extra credit homework. This was what I'm talking about. Now, all of a sudden, this kid can't even do extra credit homework. Boo, bring your butt out here and work on this project. Go work on a project.
you're going to work on all the projects. That's what you're going to do. That's your punishment. You're going to work on all the projects. You stuck. This kid came home with a whole rainbow, feeling all confident and everything. I thought you had an A, youngster. I thought you actually had an A. So it's going to be even more riskier with her having a compassion trait because uh, she's going to be a child a little longer. Um, She needs to... Uh, I don't know. I don't even know how to get those other traits that high up because it took a, a nice little minute to get it uh down the first time. You're not sitting over there. You're not sitting over there. Come sit back over here and do your homework. Dang, you don't listen. Y'all separated. I should have made it be a longer wall with doors for each one of them and lock y'all in there. Make it be a whole boot camp type thing. So this baby finna be doing that for the rest of the evening. He ain't got nothing else planned because he literally at a level seven. I don't even know what else to tell him. This chick right here, when she get done, she can come back in here and play doctor. She can play doctor. I don't know what else to tell her either. I don't have nothing for these children to do. You can't just have that, that, that. What is it? A oil machine? You can't have that well oil machine going on. There's always got to be something else going on. I'm going to have this guy to come in here and um, practice typing. Because he's at a level 6. He'll be at a level 7 in his motor skills. Mom is painting. These kids should be working on their little stuff in here. Um, She didn't did another masterpiece. So this baby already got a, a um, level 3. We're going to have her to come in here and do make-believe. I'm going to have her to do make-believe. What's Zach on? Zach still got a... Zach still got to work on um, thinking. Is it a girl boy thing? Because uh, Zach is pulling up the rear. Okay, so mom, this is another masterpiece. Cool, cool, cool. Can you do another painting? I'm going to have you to do another painting. Because I was going to have you to help this baby with his homework, but mm -mm. I mean, not his homework, but the project. But we're not doing that. We're not helping him. He gonna do that all by him, him lonesome. We is not helping him. Look at her coming out all confident. Girl, where your rainbow? You walking like you got a rainbow over your head. Yeah, she looked at her mama like, ooh, I got imaginary rainbow. <laughs> got imaginary rainbow. Get out. Ooh. Dude, his rainbow disappeared. He ain't got no rainbow no more. What happened, son? It's the homework, ain't it? The homework that messed up your rainbow. So he feeling like he needs some fun. So I'm going to have him to come in here and work on playing a game of this now. Baby girl right here have completed her imagination. So I'm going to have her to come in here and go potty. And then I want her to work on her communication. She needs to go babble. She needs to go babble, babble, babble. So she got a two, a three, a two, a three, and a three. So she got to work on communication and movement. Which I'm going to just have her to come outside and go down the slide a couple of times. Um, but she probably don't get to do all that. So this baby right here, he needs to stop. He ain't, he ain't doing nothing. You're independent, son. What's holding you back? 
Sheesh, Luis. So I'm just going to have them to do some skill building right now. So if I'm going to just play off camera. So if nothing else happened, then I'll come back when it's time for them to go to school tomorrow. Okay. I'm going to come back when it's time for them to go to school tomorrow. I'm going to just let mom sit here and paint her whole life away. And, um, oh, I actually see the ceiling. I do hope that you all enjoyed the video. Until later, goodbye.